Welcome to GWO's Garage. Today we're going to be setting up the 90 gallon tank aquarium.
The water is a little murky. We just rearranged the aquascape in there. I added some bacteria starter. We went ahead and got this 90 gallon aquarium set up with the substrate that we have in there, a light colored sand. Uh, we picked up at uh, PetSmart. Um, we used these rocks from another aquarium that we had back in the day. And that log, of course I just confiscated that out of the cichlid aquarium, but who knows, maybe the cichlids end up in here. Uh, but one of the things that I do when I start a tank to help get it cycle, I put this uh, bacteria starter in here. So um, I'm not loyal to this particular brand. It just happened to be the one that had the best uh, value at the time. So uh, in other videos, you've seen me use a different type of starter, but I certainly put this in just to kind of help the tank uh, get started and I've never had a problem. So we're going to let the haze settle out of this tank. Go ahead and float them in there. All right. That's it, that's that right there. <laughs> it's right there, just inject it in your fishy. How'd you have my pot to my fishy? My fish is like, ah, crap! <laughs> right, Carson. Yeah, good morning, right? My okay. mind doesn't like. Yeah. <laughs> no, I'm just kidding, Miss Carson. Watch out, Carson. My fish is like, why can't I even get out of this? That's what old fish are like when, they, when they're inserted to a tank in the bag, and they're like, can I have out now? <laughs> when you compare the 90 to the, to the 75, the 75 looks small, and then when I compare it to the 150, it's just that tiny. You can see the tank is much, much clearer now, but of course it's been several weeks since that last clip you just saw. And uh, what we did is those goldfish that we had in this tank, we moved them over to our 150 temporarily. And what we're gonna go ahead and put in here is our ambunas from our cichlid tank. So they're going from a 40 gallon up to this 90 gallon. And that's what we're gonna do right now. And just a quick little side story here for these uh, goldfish. Um, we bought them just to kind of help start the cycle in the 90 gallon um, because we weren't sure what we were going to do with a 90 gallon. So we just put a couple of feeders in there with our bacteria starter uh, a few weeks back. And uh, anyway, I moved these guys to this 150 gallon aquarium last night so we could put the cichlids in the 90. And that little fellow right there, the one with the most, most white on them, one on the left, got sucked up through the filter that I have temporarily set up here. I'm waiting for some parts to come in and got sucked up into the filter. And when I noticed that he was missing from the tank, I went through and said, oh gosh. So uh, I opened this up and there he was alive at the bottom of the filter. We scooped him back out, put him back in here. And then I've got a just a little net protecting, uh, protecting uh, him from that happening again. So again, this 150 is a temporary setup right now. Uh, we've got some parts coming for the filters and um, so we'll get back to that later. So, okay, so we've taken our goldfish out and put them in the 150. So, I don't know if you guys saw this, but there's also two other fish in here, a balloon molly and a giant dino. Um, so we moved those two in there, but we had to take the balloon molly out because surprisingly, it's not a strong swimmer, so it got sucked up into the filter. We, we thought it was dead. Um, we, I found it, picked it up, put it in the 150. I was worried about it, so we put it in the 75. And another goldfish got sucked up in there. Somehow survived. So we're, anyways, we're gonna put the impunas in here because they're getting a little too big. And I'm worried they might start killing each other because they do that. <laughs> Do they? Do they? <laughs> yeah, so that's what we're gonna do. Wait, 
I can count now. So there are one, two, wait, so four, five, five of the Buddhas. That means only one died? Oh no, we had six, seven. We had seven of Buddhas and then we only had five. Yes, two did. Oh, wait. That's awesome. Oh my god, I got such good shots of him. Oh, you're still here in the blue guy. We're going in the tank. I want to record this. There he goes. There goes one. And there goes the other. Oh, I didn't even get stellar. There they are. Two at once? Crazy. Look at that. They look, they look like saltwater fish. They were one of the most colorful fish. Awesome. Oh, jeez. Yes, got them both. Got them both in that. See you go. Whoa, perfect shots. Daddy, look at this. Look at that. Imagine if we get some new ones. Oh, don't let him jump. Talented! That's gonna be one of the best ones. As long as he doesn't dart off. <laughs> Where are they all? All five of them are in that log. Well, that's it. Thank you guys uh, for being here. We certainly appreciate you watching our channel and sticking with us as we went through and um, set up our 90 gallon aquarium. As you can see, we've got the Abudas in there. That's their new home now. Uh, we're going to go out and purchase some more so we can have this nice and full of Abudas. Um, i got to go back. I've got to build the... Um, i got to get some stuff canopy. to build the canopy. we got to get that situated. Um, what else we got to do, Jack? We've got... Uh, we have to... We need to get the 150 set up for a new fish coming. So the 150 gallon aquarium. We've got to get the filters uh, set up. But I had to order a couple parts. So thanks to Amazon Prime, they should be here in the next day or so. Um, so we're going to get that established, we're going to build a canopy for that. What's going into 150? So, for my birthday, I wish for a, a baby arowana and a red tail, but we can't get a red tail because they'll kill our tank. So, just the baby arowana is alright, and I just like them, they, they swim cool. That's it, so we're going to have uh, an arowana that's coming for the 150 gallon tank. So stick around if you want to see how that goes, you want to watch any of those projects. So again, we got some more Imbunas coming. We got a canopy build here. We got a canopy build for the 150. Uh, we've got some lands, uh, sub, um, aquascaping going on for the aquarium for the 150. And uh, I don't know, we're going to do something with that 40 gallon aquarium over there too. I might even dabble in a little bit of salt water. I don't know, I've never done it before. We'll give it a whirl, right? So. I mean, that takes both set up. We can just do a little salt water. This is my saltwater fish. Clownfish, uh, I'm gonna get a clownfish. We can do a little research and turn that 40 gallon into a saltwater for sure. So, Anyway, that's what's happening here at the Jibo Garage channel. Again, thank you guys very much for coming and joining us and watching our videos and hitting the like button and the subscribe button uh, so you don't miss anything that's happening, happening next on our channel. Again, thank you very much. Have a great rest of the day. Evening. Night. night. Afternoon. Morning. Something. <laughs> Take care, guys. We'll see you.